Okay, Steve, I'm sure you weren't panicking, but uh, <laughs> it must be a great relief to get that first win under the belt. It's always a relief. I mean, uh, it, it becomes... Uh, it, it, Say with the pressure of not winning, but it, you know it's in the back of your mind. And uh, I honestly feel that the, the other two games that we've had down here, we should have gone on and, and won those, but we didn't. And I said to the lads before the game today that you know we can't say an if or should have and done. You know we, we, we've got to go out and once you step over the white line, you know take the responsibility. But I think you could see the the bit of relief probably in the players today once we got ourselves one up. And you know we did talk about that at half time, and I just felt if we could get ourselves in front. We could go on and get a few more, and I think we created a lot more chances second half. It was nice to get the second one, give us a bit of a cushion. Um, but in saying that, I thought we could have, we should have had more goals really in the second half. Yeah, I thought the first half I thought was a fairly even contest. Maybe they had slightly the better of the chances. I mean, they hit the post, and yeah. uh, the guy went through. I think there was a couple. Adam yeah, I think there was. I think I think if you look at their chances, they came from our errors. And particularly the one where uh, Tom and Sam uh, left it for one another, and the lads run through. I think it was Marsden run through, and yeah. Adams pulled off a great save. Obviously, the lad on marks at the back stick, uh, who's at the post. You know things like that. that. That's the sort of things that we're trying to drum into them. That you've got to concentrate for a, for the full 90 minutes. Um, but um, I think I think the first half, I think you could just see that little bit of. Uh, anxiety in us to to because uh, the lads are jumping at the bit to do well for everybody here you can see that the the surface is still a bit lively um and maybe where a first time ball for lads they've got it in their heads where if they're trying a first time ball it's going to maybe bobble away from them but you've got to try and be as positive as you can the pitch is getting better and you know i think you know once we get a bit of rain on it it'll 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 sort of it, it'll settle down but um because we want to play you know, and there's times maybe when we're we're trying to play and we're we're wrestling with the ball because hey, the service ain't quite what we want at the minute. Second half, I thought we were looked a very good side in the second half. Yeah, I think I think like I say, once once we scored, I mean Joe's got his goal today, which will give him do him the world of good. Um, you could just see that that sort of confidence starting to come back into the players and we made a little change with uh, Brisk coming on and he added a bit of quality uh, to what we were trying to do but uh, yeah I thought second half we we created a lot of chances can't really think maybe I think they had one where Adams made a good save but I thought Isaac for his first game did well for us nice and lively up there um, and we need to build on this now for for Tuesday obviously yeah uh, big game Tuesday with Hans with, yep. uh, Coming up, another of your old clubs. Yeah, they're all my old clubs, aren't they? <laughs> yeah. I'm not saying you've been around a bit. But. <laughs> no, I, I always look forward to going back up there, and um, and, uh, and we'll look forward to it. I know we'll take a good following, and um, and there's no reason why we can't, you know, if we if we carry on from where we left off today and how we've played, there's no reason why we can't go and get ourselves another three points, and that'll put us in good spirits for the FA Cup game on uh, a week on Saturday. Coming back to today, um, we've spoken the two goals. It's nice to get a first clean sheet as well. But it's always nice to get a clean sheet. If you get a clean sheet, you don't lose. Gonna... But I mean, for me, we were two 0 up, and I wanted to get, I wanted us to get a third. I'm just how I am, and I know, I know it was late on, <laughs> but you know, I, I just see little gaps opening up for forwards, and I just was, I was after that third. Probably yeah. if we'd got the third, I'd have been after the fourth. But <laughs> hey, today, what it's all about is getting that first win under our belt. It's, it's, it's brought a lot of uh, belief, obviously, into the, into the camp, which we had before, but I think maybe little things were perhaps just haven't been running for us. But we've got to make things like that happen, and especially in that final third. And I thought today we created a lot of good chances. You know, the one that I don't know how the, man, the lads edited it off the line from the corner, the set piece that we worked on. And little stuff like that, we're working on those on, on Thursday nights, training with me, gets, gets them, and, you know, we work on set pieces. But how he's edited that away, I'll, I'll never know. Yeah, look, he looked to a certain goal from the moment uh, he hit it. Yeah, because he? he caught yeah, it so sweet yeah. and uh, and the lads added it yeah. off the line. But hey, it's, we'll enjoy today and we'll get ready for Tuesday. Just a, a word on the team. Harry Ben's missing today. Is, yeah, it? Harry's, Harry um, uh, had a slight hamstring. Uh, so we'll have to assess. We're hoping that he might be fit for, for Tuesday. Um, but it'll all be down to him getting a good training session under his belt improving his fitness so uh, it's a shame really because he's shown some really good signs for us over the last uh, couple of games that he's played in but um, hey, we don't want to be risking anything and Port Bell won't want us risking anything in, in being out longer term so we've got to make sure that he's uh, he's 100% right. Okay, cheers Steve. Okay. Thank you.